Yo, 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 yo. What's good, everybody, man? It's Skinny SRT back with another video for y'all guys, man. But make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. 2024, we going up. Trying to reach 100K in 2024. So make sure you subscribe up. This video here is about Mr. Organic, man. And um, it's people like Mr. Organic, CJ So Cool, and others. That's the real, real reason the black car community is messed up. Especially the black uh, Mopar community. It's because... um. People like Mr. Organic, Tall Guy Car Reviews, CJ So Cool, they um, portray this here type of lifestyle. And um, they are not real car enthusiasts. They are not real Hellcat enthusiasts. But they go out there and they preach this here lifestyle. And then real people go out here and follow this. And they end up being in all types of debt. But he calls himself a money guru. This man here had uh, uh, pump and dump cryptocurrency schemes he was uh, promoting. Uh, this man actually thought that he could grow old till he was like 70 or 80 with a green beard. It's crazy to me. This man says he's the king of downtown, but we never see him with no woman, no legit woman that he's not paid for. Uh, Danielle Champion was a paid for beard. Um, it's just weird to me. It's weird to me. And um, everything is showing now. He's crumbling. I don't even really know why I'm talking about him because I'm bringing uh, more relevancy to him because nobody knows who he is right now. Uh, he's died. Uh, he's lost his uh, Incredible Hulk beard. He's lost almost all his cars. Uh, as you can see, man, he's lost his cameraman. He's pawned his jewelry, claimed that uh, it got stolen. All type of stuff, man. He's now... Uh, riding um, fresh and fits wave. He doesn't even have a wave of his own no more. He's just like a stepchild out here. Like, tall guy car abused, just drug him along, got him a wife, and then just left him out here. Tall guy car abused, that's another video for another time. But right now we're talking about uh, Mr. Organic. And what Mr. Organic does is he tries to twist and manipulate the minds of these here younger uh, people out here. Like, say between the ages of 18 and uh, 30 and tries to get them to mess up their credit, get all these here expensive model cars and this and that and just say do it. He doesn't give you no plan on how to pay for it or none of that. He just says go out there and get it and you'll figure it out. No, nah, life doesn't work like that. And for you to try to instill these here values in other black people, man, you ain't no superhero. You ain't no superhero. Um, You might look like a gargoyle, but you ain't trying to uh, use that gargoyle gang to uplift anybody, bro. Um, you just another guy on YouTube that got caught out there basically, you know, panhandling the public. You was panhandling the public. You was acting like uh, you was a celebrity. You was a movie star. All this here stuff. You was a tough guy. Um, you was in the mafia. You was all that. And now you was just a broke representation, wearing your own clothes that nobody buys no more. I don't understand this. This story could have been great. You actually could have been giving back to the community. Um, you actually could have been giving seminars to show people how to be great. And now the people that's buying your seminars now, I don't know who they are, bro. They calling this here like the Mr. Organic uh, Life Class. Who would buy that? What imbecile would buy that? What is he showing y'all to make y'all pay for a class? What is he showing y'all? He's literally living on Fresh and Fit's floor. He's living on the floor of Fresh and Fit's studio. If Fake It Till You All Make It was a picture, it would be him. It would be him. I've exposed this man for wearing fake Jordans. This man went and took his brother's super stock back. The headliner was dang on there falling off, man. This man, and see, we got to do a better job of policing our own community. Um, if you are literally Mopar or no car, or if y'all SRT, or if y'all Dodge lovers, Hellcat lovers, it's people like this that you need to keep out. People like this you need to keep out. Like, watch people, man. Watch people like myself. Hemi E, 
Um, watch people like Ice Cream Vlogs, bro. Watch people like Ice Cream Vlogs. He holds these people accountable, man. He holds these people accountable. Do you know Mr. Organic tried to portray himself as a guru? As a guru. Spencer Cornelia had to go check this man, make videos on this man. And after Spencer Cornelia made videos on this man, this man's here career. Man can't get 10,000 views a video, man. Man can't get 10,000 views. He went from hundreds of thousands of views a video to under 10,000 views. And I Scream Vlogs has a lot to do with that because I stopped talking about the guy. Um, yeah, I stopped talking about the guy. It was no money in talking about this here guy. Uh, he had been exposed. Um, just look at him, man. Just look at him, man. His name is not even Mr. Organic no more. It's Jarvis. It's Jarvis. And that's what happens when you get on here and you tell lies. You tell lies about your lifestyle. You can't uphold it. Now look at you. Now look at you, man. Charleston White got more gold than you. And it amazes me the type of people that still rock out with you. Like I see somebody in your chat named Mopar Malley. How could you rock out with this guy? And this guy is saying that he doesn't even like Dodgers no more. This is what I don't understand. This is what I don't understand, man. This man here is trying to keep up with the Joneses, but nobody is doing what he's doing. Nobody is making these here dumb decisions of what he's doing, man. Nobody. It used to be a whole wave of these guys. It used to be him, um, some Santa guy, tall guy. It was a whole wave of these here clowns. These here um, going around talking about how they was millionaires and you got to have you a Hellcat and all this here stuff. Him. Him. Y'all don't even see them no more. You know why? Because they wasn't real Mopar enthusiasts. They wasn't real SRT enthusiasts. They wasn't. They were just doing this here for the clicks and views. So, with all that being said, um, hey, 2023 was the downfall of Mr. Organic. And I can't say that I'm um, sad to see it. <laughs> for real. Because anybody, any grown man over the age of 40 that gets on here with a green beard and um, tries to do the stuff that he does, do y'all know this man was selling a ski mask for $100? Promising stuff that he did not fulfill? Get in the comment section let me know what y'all think. I'm um, Miss Skinny SRT, and I'm out.